practice tip is actually a number of practice tips to help you master fast music. In the past few weeks we've talked about how to use your metronome to improve your subdivision. Last week we talked about utilizing the two-click method, but sometimes using the two-click method doesn't always work. These are a few of my tips that I've learned over the years from various teachers or from just experimenting on my own that I hope you can take home and use in your own practice session. First of all, just make sure your fundamentals are really, really awesome, especially when you're practicing in the slow tempos. For clarinet players, that means making sure our fingers are curved, embouchure is right, tongue position, air support, hand position, all of those things are working properly together to produce a beautiful sound, even at the slow tempos. Here's where things get fun. Suppose you're working through the two-click method, you get to one spot that your fingers don't like. Last week I worked on the passage from Scheherazade, and this week I'm going to work on that as well. My fingers really hate the interval going from E flat, this pinky, to C sharp, C sharp here. For some reason, my pinkies do not like to coordinate that very well. When I get to an uncomfortable tempo in the two-click method, and I just start to kind of notice a little bit of tension in my body or my fingers or hands, or even just a little bit of a messy transition between two notes, I'll stop and I'll isolate that interval and I'll just play it several times back and forth, just getting everything worked out. Another thing you can do is isolate that one treble interval and add one note behind and one note in front of every few repetitions. rhythms. You basically alternate playing each note long and each note short. So long, short, long, short, long, short, long, short, long, short, long, and then short, long, short, long, short, long, short, long, short, long, short, long. If you do that a number of times, it just trains your fingers to play in a controlled way and it makes it much easier to transition into playing it at a very consistent tempo. So let me show you how to clean it up. each other. Thank you so much for watching and as always, happy practicing!